Nice. Hello guys, this video is in continuation of the earlier video that we saw where we used a distance sensor motor to get the distance of the object from our sensor. So here we are going to use a vibration motor as well. So what is a vibration motor? A vibration motor is simply a motor which produces vibrations when current is passed through it. So you might be thinking, why are we using the vibration motor and we've used the distance sensor and vibration sensor is being used now. It doesn't even make sense. Actually, it does make sense. So there is a very nice simple project that say for blind people, you know that blind people cannot see what is in front of them. So let's say you are an engineer and you know of the distance sensor and you also know of vibration motor. So what you are going to do, you are going to design a special gloves which uses the distance sensor to measure the object distance and let's say when the object is at a distance of 15 centimeter that vibration motor is actually outputs a current I'm sorry my bad the vibration motor outputs the vibrations which are being sensed by our blind person so that he knows say after 15 centimeters i will face a wall or i will face any object so this helps and this helps the blind person and so this is how it will happen here you can see the major distance is about 110 centimeters so the vibration motor is not moving so let me reduce the object distance to less than 50 centimeter here is 43 centimeter and you can see the vibration motor is moving here you see yes this is what will happen in real life as well if we implement it on a glove so congratulations you have helped a blind guy by making his life a little bit easier i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you learned a lot from this video so you can now understand how we use different components that we learned we learned the ultrasonic sensor and then we learned about the vibration motor so it was the creativity of an engineer who came up with the idea that we can use these two sensors to help people we can make their lives better so whatever sensor you are using whatever motors whatever anything you are using you will always be able to help anyone if you can only think out of the box and can create a solution which helps humanity as a whole. Thank you.